Hey guys, and welcome back to a new video. It's been a little while, but that's alright. I've been kind of struggling to come up with guides and tutorial videos because I've pretty much already talked about everything that there is. And there's nothing really new that is coming up with the game. Uh, but there has been new characters, so I'm thinking of doing guides on how to beat specific characters. And today I'm going to be starting off with Hero because he's a new character and not a lot of people know how to play against him especially with Lucario. So yeah, I'm going to be doing a video on how to be Hero while playing as Lucario. And I'm thinking of turning this into a little bit of a series on like how to beat specific characters with Lucario. If you guys want to see more videos like this one, let me know down below in the comments. So the first tip I'm going to give is probably the most important tip of all time in this matchup. And that is do not throw out Aura Sphere or Force Palm Flame when Hero has the Bounce spell out. Good Hero players will use this spells on Lucario as much as they possibly can. So yeah, just straight up do not use Aura based moves for a solid 20 to 30 seconds. Use a lot of normal moves, a lot of grabs. You can still use Force Palm Grab, however it's still really risky because even if you're positioning is off just by a little bit, Force Palm Flame will come out instead and it'll get reflected and obviously do damage to you. I think it's kind of obvious, however, it can be kind of hard to change up your playstyle mid-match, especially with Hero, because that's what you're constantly going to have to do in order to beat him. The next tip is going to be to use Aura Sphere a lot. I know, it kind of counters what I just said, right? Well, yeah, when Bounce is not out, you should be using Aura Sphere a lot. Aura Sphere can go through most of Hero's spells. For example, his Neutral B. At, lid, at mid to low percents, it may clank or trade, but at higher percents, a fully charged Aura Sphere will go completely through his Neutral B and a lot of his down specials as well. One thing to really look out for and to pay attention to is when Hero players uses spells that will buff their stats. These spells are Accelerate, Oomph, and Psych Up. Good hero players will only pull out the command menu when you're being knocked really far away or off the stage, after they KO you, or after they come back down from the angel platform after being killed. During this time when a hero has these spells activated, in my opinion your best bet is to just time them out. Don't engage with them, run away, and shoot a lot of aura spheres. It feels at times we really gotta play this matchup super lame. A few other things to pay attention to are kind of obvious, but I mean it's still something to note. His super deadly spells. These ones include Kamikaze, Magic Burst, Kaboom, Bang, and Thwack. All of these spells can kill you very early, which is obviously not good for Lucario. And with a lot of these spells, you kind of just want to stay far away from them. Because if you are far away from them, you might not get hit by them. For example, like Kamikaze or Magic Burst. One quick thing that I actually forgot to put in this video was you're going to want to watch out whenever Hero uses the snooze spell. I know, that sounds kind of obvious, don't get hit by it. However, as many of you already know, this projectile will make you fall asleep mid-air, especially while you're beer reversing. Now this same situation had happened to me twice during this match and twice during this set that I would beer reverse an aura sphere and get hit by snooze. And the animation looks really funny and really weird, but yeah, I end up falling asleep on top of a platform and he gets the kill for me. So definitely watch out for Snooze. One more thing to pay attention to is Hero's MP. If Hero has no MP, he is forced to approach you, because although he can auto-generate MP over time, it's very, very slow. He will gather more MP as he hits you. So if he has no MP, again, just run away like a little bitch the entire time, don't let him hit you, shoot a ton of aura spheres, and if you can knock him off stage, that's great because if he has low MP, he might not even be able to make it back to the stage. Well, speaking of getting Hero off stage, what should you do when he's off stage? Well, I think the best bet is to stand near the ledge and down air him as you can. Hero is completely vulnerable when he is rising from his recovery. I would not go too far low or to the edge to edge guard him because if his tornadoes do hit you, they're really weird and you can easily die or get spiked by them if you're not careful enough. But what if you're off stage? Well that's also a little bit tricky because Hero has options to deal with that. You're going to need to mix up your recovery options. You're going to want to recover from the side and from below. If you recover from the side, he can use his neutral B or even his side B 
to interrupt that. However, if you go low, he might just use his up B and have the tornadoes hit you. I don't think his up B will work that well due to how fast Lucario's extreme speed is. However, I w it's still something to definitely look out for and be careful of. Oh yeah, and lastly, don't really recover onto stage because our landing lag is super long and Hero can probably just get an easy smash attack or even a spell in. A good thing to keep in mind while playing Hero is that most of his melee specials are pretty laggy and you can easily just punish him for using one. A really easy way to beat Hero is to just let him SD while he's choosing his commands offstage. This was more of a joke, but I mean like, it can still happen. Uh, good hero players probably won't let this happen, however it's still something that I find really funny is they're just trying to they're trying to look for zoom and they end up killing themselves over it and I find it really hilarious. One thing as well is when hero uses the metal spell, the best thing you can do is just wait this one out because you're both kind of you're, you're both gonna be at a standstill. There's not really gonna be too much going on. However, you can charge a smash attack if you time this correctly and get an insanely good punish off of this. So if Hero doesn't do anything and you time it correctly, you can get a fully charged uh, smash attack in as we can see in this clip. So yeah, when he uses the metal, metal spell, just wait, just wait it out. Just wait it out. That's all you have to do is just wait it out and you can punish it with a smash attack, force spring grab, whatever you want to do. But just wait until he comes out of it and then you can get your punish. Another really easy way to beat Hero is to just let him blow himself up. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> I guess that's a thing too. You legit don't have to do anything. These last two tips, you don't have to do anything. Just let these last three tips i'm sorry these last three tips you literally don't have to do anything hero kills himself the metal one okay you might have to wait it out a little bit and be patient but regardless these three you are not doing anything you are letting hero kill himself but um yeah literally if hero chooses kamikaze if you if you're playing this matchup really well and you're staying far away from hero shooting a bunch of aura spheres and he chooses kamikaze while you're on the other side of the stage that is a free stock for you you don't have to do anything so yeah seriously just when playing hero stay really far away from him let him blow himself up if he has to it's it's that easy to be completely honest well other than that i think we've pretty much covered it all and that's how to beat hero with lucario if you guys like this video let me know and maybe i'll do more videos like this i kind of like this and i've asked people on twitter and on the youtube community tab as well if they would like to see more videos like this so if you guys want to see more videos like this leave comments down below on who you want to see me do next time um but with that being said don't forget to join my Discord, follow me on Twitter, and subscribe for more Lucario content.